Hello, welcome to The Word in a Flash. I'm Dr. Freddie B. Wilson. Today's subject is The Truth Hurts. There's a popular line in the movie that goes, You can't handle the truth. No matter what you're facing, the truth is God has the power to deliver you through it all. There are examples in the Bible where God was blessing his people, but the people still began to doubt. We have to pay attention to the direction God gives us in life. God knows our problems even before we are aware of them. Exodus 14 and 19 reads, Then the angel of God, who had been leading the people of Israel, moved to the rear of the camp. The pillar of cloud also moved from the front and stood behind them. We don't have to see with our natural eyes all the things that God is doing behind the scenes on your behalf uh, in whatever circumstance you may find yourself in. If you have a close relationship with God and you hear him giving you instructions, you shouldn't be afraid to do whatever it is he tells you to do, even though you don't initially understand why he's having you do it. I've had many occasions where God has instructed me to do something that I thought was impossible. Every time I did was something that God told me to do, success followed. One example of that is that God told me to go back to a certain bank for a loan that I needed. I told God that that bank had recently turned me down for that very loan. Though apprehensive, I went ahead and did what God instructed me to do. I went back to that bank. Guess what? The bank approved that loan. God is the master of possibilities. Exodus 14, 26 through 28 reads, When all the Israelites had reached the other side, the Lord said to Moses, Raise your hand over the sea again. Then the waters will rush back and cover the Egyptians and their chariots and charioteers. So as the sun began to rise, Moses raised his hands over the sea and the water rushed back into its usual place. The Egyptians tried to escape, but the Lord swept them into the sea. Then the waters returned and covered all the chariots and charioteers, the entire army of Pharaoh. Of all the Egyptians who had chased the Israelites into the sea, not a single one survived. That passage shows the power of the Lord when the Lord acts on your behalf. When God acts on your behalf, no one can stop him. It's okay to acknowledge the facts or the problems that you're facing, but you should state more of the truth of what God can do. One perspective of a believer is that God is in front of you, making a safe pathway while he's covering you from the back. I learned from my current pastor that you must be able to realize to yourself that my purpose and progress is a process. Isaiah 40, 28 through 29 reads, Have you ever heard? Have you never understood? The Lord is the everlasting God, the creator of all the earth. He never grows weak or weary. No one can measure the death of his understanding. He gives power to the weak and strength to the powerless. Understand something, the truth hurts when you fail to acknowledge God's power and ability to change your circumstances. This hurts because you would endure the pain of your circumstances because you fail to ask God for help. God knows your pain and he sees what you're going through. Call on the Lord and be prepared for him to lift your burden. As always, God does things in his own time, but trust me, he will lift your burden in due time. The truth is, you should you live your life seeking God's will, and you will be blessed. Take care.